Hi everyone, my name is Christopher Walker and today we're going to be talking about the drawing tools that you have within Google Jamboard. So once you're in your Google Jam, you're going to look to the left hand side and look at that tool bar that you have right there. And we're actually going to utilize the first um, icon option and that is the drawing option. Now you have four different drawing options there at the top and then six different colors. Um, the first option is what it's preset to and that's a pen. Um, and we're going to actually change the color to blue and I'm going to show you what that looks like. So you can see it will follow your finger or stylus or whatever you're using on your mobile device. Um, and it's kind of thin like a pen normally is. Uh, if we click back over there, the second option is a marker, and so we're going to change to green. So you can see this option is slightly thicker. Uh, if we go back, our third option is a highlighter. And so with the highlighter, it works just like a normal one. So you can see how it has like a slightly darker beginning, and then it fades out. And if you go over top of it multiple times, it is going to get darker. If we click our um, drawing tools again, we have the last option, which is a paintbrush. And this one to me seems very similar to like a watercolor paintbrush. You'll notice it um, expands right after you draw. Um, and if you draw over the same spot, it's going to get slightly darker. And I'm gonna clear the frame because I wanna show you one other section within the drawing. So if we go back to drawing, um, you'll notice at the bottom it says assistive drawing tools and then it has that little arrow to the right. We're going to click that arrow and it's going to open up and there's going to be three different options that you have down there. The first one is an assistive text drawing tool. So I'm going to change back to black for my color and we're going to click out. So this one um, takes your handwriting and it turns it into text letters. Um, so we can draw the different letters that we are thinking of and it will turn them into text letters. Now this one is tricky and sometimes you have to be a little more precise. Um, so make sure that you try to draw the best you can. Um, if we go back up there, we'll see there is a second option which is the assistive shape drawing tool. Um, and so with this one, you can start to draw shapes and it's going to create them into perfect shapes, which is really nice when you're trying to teach um, different geometric or math skills or maybe just shapes um, in a lower grade level. I'm going to clear my frame for the last option. So there is one other one, and this one is the assistive drawing doodling tool. Um, and so with this one, what it likes to do is it will um, look at what you're drawing and it will start to assume what it thinks you're drawing. And so you can see there, there's some options there at the bottom that I can pick from, and I can even scroll through and see if there's any other options that are similar to what I want. I like this one. And when you click on it, it's going to change your drawing into an actual doodle drawing that it has. Um, and then from there, you can um, move it with the arrow and then draw over top of it and so on and so forth. I hope you enjoyed the short tutorial on the different drawing tool options that you have within Google Jamboard.